Ireland's cancer rate is one of the highest in the world, and over 29,000 people were diagnosed here in 2009. It is estimated that by 2020, 40,000 new cases will be diagnosed annually. We met up with Jerry Collins, who has fought this disease, and this is his story. I've smoked over 60 cigarettes a day, I'm ashamed to say. Um, I drank a fair few pints. I was living a kind of a manic lifestyle. I was in the business, and um, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed the buzz. I have to say, I live for the buzz. Jerry decided to change his lifestyle and took up boxing. But after a period of time, he noticed a swelling on his neck. He was diagnosed with cancer of the base of the tongue. He was 50 years old. It was a stage two cancer tumor um, and required um, chemotherapy and, radio and radiotherapy, <coughs> both. Scared, I was very afraid, uh, terrified, uh, being honest, because cancer is such a, is a scary word. Jerry spent nine months having treatment, which had a huge effect on him, both physically and emotionally. You're, out, you're away from life, and, and you, you kind of get away of life going to the hospital every day. But then all of a sudden you're out here in real life, and you're on your own, and you've got to get on with it. And that, that, that requires um, a degree of maturity and toughness as well to get back into that, and anybody who's had cancer will understand what I mean. Boxing played a huge part in Jerry's recovery. The big thing for me was to get back training. I needed to get back as fast as I could. I love it. And I go every week, every Tuesday and Thursday, seven days. I would say there's fantastic hope for, for anybody who is diagnosed with cancer today. No harm in a few prayers. You know, if you have a higher power, you know, ask for a bit of help. I did, and, and uh, I, I certainly found one. I'm very grateful. I feel um, gifted in many ways.